Welcome back, everybody. It's 641. Storytellers from across the state will come together this weekend for a special conference. One of those storytellers, Buck Creasy, you're from Georgetown. Good morning. Good morning. Pleasure to see you this morning. And uh, we're talking about this. This is a very cool event and something that kind of honors something that we've all been doing since we had the ability to speak and that That's is tell exactly right. stories to each other. Absolutely. Talk about what's going to happen this weekend, some of the things you got going on. Fantastic. Well, this weekend we're going to have a lot of people gather in Richmond. Uh, everything is going to be in, uh, we're going to, the deaf and hard of hearing can also attend because they have interpreters. We're going to talk about storytelling. People gather from all over the state. Literally uh, over a hundred people will be there, uh, share stories, swap stories, tell stories themselves, and also work on the craft. And this is, a, as we were talking before the uh, interview here, <laughs> Kentucky has a rich history, Absolutely. A, a rich oral history, and a lot of great stories to tell, whether they're political stories, whether they're stories from Appalachia, all kinds of stories. We're going to hear some of those, right? Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, our new um, upcoming president is Pam Holcomb. She is from down in the mountains of Kentucky. She's a traditional mountain storyteller, as she'll be telling, of, of course. And uh, everybody else, uh, Mary Hamilton, who is actually uh, has the equivalent of the Hall of Fame of Storytellers. Mm -hmm. uh, with the uh, Circle of Excellence Award will also be there. Entertainment, and you said you had a 15 second story for me. Absolutely. Give it to me. All right. He was lying on the floor holding his leg, writhing in pain as she blew the smoke away from the muzzle of the 38 and stuck it back in her purse. At the door, she paused and said, next time, give her your own cell phone number. There you go. Kind of an old story. <laughs> I think that's uh, A7 in our rundown, but uh, <laughs> let's uh, talk about uh, where this is again. It's at EKU, right? Absolutely. And EKU uh, over there in the, oh my gosh, I forgot the building. Heavens, for, go to the website, <laughs> www.kystory.org. KY Story, there. that's right. Yeah, KY Story, you can register there. You can. <laughs> That's okay. That's a story you can tell uh, uh, can another day. It, but KY yeah. Story, it's at EKU. Yeah. You can find it. Just go to EKU's website yeah. or kystory.org. And entertaining in both. And stories is Extremely something. Extremely expensive. 20 bucks. 20, wow, 20 whole dollars. So uh, hit mom up for some money before you go. But uh, Buck, thank you for coming in. Thank you. And it's a skill that we should have as broadcasters. Absolutely. And you definitely have. So once again, kystory.org. And speaking of stories, Mary has one to do has one to tell about the weather. It's going to start not so great, but it's going to end pretty nice. She has the details coming up next. Have a good day. I will.